Go do a quick video on canopies for these vintage X wings. All right. Now I purchased a couple reproduction ones intentionally from a seller on eBay that's out of Australia. Reproductions are they're beautiful. They're almost spot on. You can tell that the reproduction is out if you know what you're looking at. So here's an original canopy. You know, the plastic's yellowed from age. This was purchased with an original X-Wing as part of a lot that I purchased from a private seller. Now, you can see in the top there, see those lines? It's hard to see. There's actually lines molded in. Decorative lines there. Okay. And then you've got the pegs down here. Now, this is a very nice reproduction, in my opinion. And it's marked on the inside here with a number two up between the hinge pegs. So that right there should can show you that this is not a real one. Additionally, it's simply frosted up top. It does not have those additional lines in there for detail. These pegs were also too wide. Um, I had to grind both of them down to get it to fit an X-Wing fighter, a vintage original. So there's your clear one. Now, this one, again, this is an original that came with an original piece that I picked up from a private seller. Again, you can see the detail lines there. The extra detail in the original. You've got your pegs, just like the clear one. Okay. Now, this is reproduction out of Australia, again. Beautiful injector molded piece. It's got the pegs on the top here. Again, it's frosted. It does not have the detail there that the original piece had. On the inside, it's marked with the number one in the mold. And again, these pegs were too wide. I had to grind them to get this to fit a vehicle. So those are original canopies. You can see that the, the color is slightly off also. This is your reproduction one. This is your original one. And obviously your an original clear one is going to be yellowed just because it's so old. Now, this is a Power of the Force unit. So this is an original canopy on a Power of the Force unit. As you can see, it's got sort of a bluish gray color to it to sort of match this paint. It is definitely different than your original. It's got that blue tint to it. Now on the top, this doesn't have that extra fancy detail that the original ones from the original toy set from late 70s, early 80s. It's got the pegs on the inside. It's not marked in any way like the reproduction ones. So that should give you a half decent idea of what to look for when you're looking at canopies. I'm not saying these are the only reproduction ones out there and that's the only way to tell, but I'm guessing that if they have the, these uh, these lines molded into them at the top, as long as you know the numbers molded on the inside, hopefully they're not reproduction ones, is to try and help somebody not get ripped off by a seller that's uh, not so honest trying to pass off a toy that's got these reproduction parts on there. I personally like the reproduction stuff for my own collection and for my child to play with because why just why take the chance of destroying an original canopy when the kid can play with something that's still a little pricey, but if it breaks, it's not the end of the world. But I also don't try and sell something saying that it's original. So, 
hopefully this helps somebody.